Hey, this is Matthew Lucursi, and you're watching TDC Mountain! Hey folks, it's Nick and Mitch. Damn, it's hot in here. <laughs> And we've just come out of Captain America, and we have to say that the movie is well worth it. And at the end of the movie, there's the first trailer for The, the Avengers. Avengers. A teaser trailer to yes. tease us, but just enough to get us interested and, get, and make us want, not want to wait 12 months to see the fucking movie. Yeah, but the good news is that the movie's releasing May 2012. Well, I guess it's 10 months. 10 months? Yes. It'll go by fast, especially in winter. <laughs> okay. So, anyways, this one has uh, uh, Stanley in it, like usual, and he actually has a longer speaking part than in any other movie. Yes. So, kudos to Stanley for that. The actors are all well and properly placed. Hugo Weaving being cast as the Red Skull is a stroke of genius. Never once did we ever think that he'd actually say Mr. Anderson. You can turn your camera away now. Actually, and we didn't think about Lord of the Rings, we didn't actually think of anything because the only time you actually get to see his face is when he has the mask over the Red Skull. The actual makeup job for and the Red, Red Skull. Red Skull has no face, he just has a hole for his nose and a bunch of red skin. A little bit more than that. Anyways, uh, there's. Very white teeth. Steve, uh, Steve Buscemi, not Steve Buscemi, uh, what's his name, um, I can't remember the name of the, the, the actors, great, I've got a hole in my skull, hmm, but anyways, I'll put the list in the Valdi so that you guys can see all the actors that were actually involved in the movie, um, it was amazing, the chemistry that they gave them in the movie was unlike any others that we've seen so far, it was actually much better than Thor, Actually, if Thor was fun, but th this yeah, was but this better. was 150 times better. Yeah, 150 times better. Even without Natalie Portman. Yeah, true. But the, um, the the movie itself is well scripted. There's no lack of action, no lack of humor, and uh, there might be a few changes here and there because I never read the Captain America comic Neither book series. I I, wrote, I read some of the Avenger comics. That's it. Yeah. And I remember Bucky kicking the bucket in the series. He also kicks the bucket in this one. I won't tell you how, but I think they changed the ending. Um, I think in the original Captain Captain America comic book series, Bucky bit the big one with a bullet. Here, he goes to great heights. Bucky was a psychic. Bucky had to die. Bucky died. Yeah. So anyways, uh, there's other actors that you'll actually see that you've seen in other movies. Um, that are actually playing supporting roles uh, that actually make the movie as it is. The actor who played Tony Stark's father had one hell of a great role. Yeah. So anyways, for the movie, it's an absolute two thumbs up to go see it while it's in theaters. Yes. From me and from Mitch. And luckily, thanks to our fantastic 2D glasses, no headaches. Yes. We didn't have to watch it in 3D. On the way back, I, I, I went back to the ticket, the ticket booth and gave them back the unopened package of 3D, 3D glasses and walked out with my 2D glasses that I got from Thinky.com. Yep, we're not being paid for the product placement, but the, it's the only place that we've noticed that they sell them. They sell them for what, $8 each? $8.99, yeah. $8.99 each, and uh, they're worth it. The unfortunate downside is look at the construction. They it's plastic. It's, it's made, made in China. It's made in China, well made, so no. So, uh, I, suppose if it, I suppose if it costs the same as a. If they're all metal and. A real pair of glasses? Yeah, the, who'd pay 100 bucks for a pair of 2D You'd glasses? You'd be surprised. I would. Ray Bans collectibles. But I wouldn't, I, wouldn't have, I wouldn't have the money for it. But. Neither would I. So, anyways, that's our product review. I liked it actually. The only thing that I have to complain about is probably the nose bridge because it's one molded piece, but at least they made sure that it was somewhat comfortable. Yeah, it reminds me of the first pair of glasses I had when I was a kid. Oh. You look like you look like Buddy Holly. Yeah. <laughs> anyways, folks, this is me 
and my sidekick will never kick the bucket. <laughs> we'll see. Have a nice one. Fiddles.